another Eurovision review. And this time it is the turn of Romania. Their song this year is called On a Sunday. It's performed by Esther Peony. Uh, and I gotta say, first of all, I love Romania in the Eurovision Song Contest. Uh, I'm always looking forward to seeing what they'll send. They're one of the countries that I'm I sort of keep an eye on the most that I have the highest expectation of because they've sent so many fantastic entries over the years. Uh, this one is maybe not as brilliant as some of the others. Probably not. It's not as catchy as a lot of the things that they've sent over the past, let's say, decade. Um, this has a melody that's kind of disjointed. It's an interesting melody, an interesting melodic line, uh, but it is, it does come off as kind of disjointed and not really, not, not catchy in the traditional sense. Um, I think a lot is going to depend on the presentation. They did something really cool in the, their national selections with this, uh, the flowing water that they had on stage, sort of raining behind her on the flowing water coming down off the stage. It's a little hard to explain, but I've, of course I've linked to that video in the um, video description so you can go see it. It's really interesting. I, I liked it. Um, it reminded me, not because of the melody or anything, but of the Under Lloyd Webber song, Tell Me on a Sunday. I think that's Lloyd Webber. Um, just because of this sort of yeah, Sunday mood. It's raining. Something depressing's happened. Because um, this is about the same thing. This is about someone who gets broken up with. Um, and in that respect, of course, the music fits pretty well. And even though the, the melody is a little strange and is kind of disjointed, I think it fits the song really well. And I think that this is one of those songs that benefits from not being one of the big five and uh, not representing one of the big five because this song definitely improves on repetition um, already the second time you hear it you're already sort of grasping it more um, so I think a lot will depend on the presentation it, it has to sort of create the mood that they want but it can't be sort of too much because then that will distract too much from the song and I think that Esther is, she has an interesting voice and she is confident on stage which is a big plus and yeah they need a presentation that sort of builds her up but doesn't distract from her so that's a little tricky but uh, I have faith in Romania I they've sent so much great stuff and I will be shocked if they don't get through from the semi-finals with this. Cause this is, um, yeah, it's not as catchy as a lot of what they've been used to sending, but it's definitely a strong entry. It's interesting. It stands out a little bit. And I'm really, really looking forward to seeing if they will bring the flowing water with them to Tel Aviv.